Hi everyone, Diane here with Terrific Planner again. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys a soup recipe. It is my um, orzo, my chicken orzo soup. Orzo chicken soup? I think it's orzo chicken soup. Um, uh, so yeah, that's what I'm sharing with you guys today. It's the recipe to it and how I make it. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. This is chicken orzo soup. This is a really easy and fast soup to make. Um, but, um, this is what you're gonna need here. You're gonna need, um, three celery stalks. And then you're also going to need four carrots. You're gonna need some olive oil. You're gonna need some, um, orzo. And you're gonna need about a cup and a half of the orzo. Um, and I use this one here from Trader Joe's. But you can use any kind that you find. Um, then you're gonna need... Eight cups, possibly a little bit more, depending on how much liquid you like in your soup, of um, chicken stock. Each one of these contains four cups, so I have two of these cartons. And then you're going to need some chicken. Okay, so as I said before, this should only take a few minutes. Um, it doesn't take that long to make this soup. It should take you no more than 15 minutes. Um, but you just get a little bit of your oil. Pour it in. And I have about that much in there. Um, I never really measure my oil. I don't put that much in, but I would say about a tablespoon and a half. Tablespoon to tablespoon and a half. Then you turn your soup pot on. And you let that heat up. Now, I have it in medium heat, so that's what we're going to start with. Once it heats up a little, we're going to put in our vegetables. Okay, so our oil is heated. Now we're going to go ahead and put our vegetables in. Put all that in there. And our carrots as well. And we will let that cook up for a bit here. Now you want this to cook the vegetables, so it'll be anywhere from five to seven minutes. Um, depends on how you like them, um, just to bring out the flavor. So I will let this cook up a bit and then I'll come back to show you the next step. All right, so our next step is adding our chicken, our chicken stock. Um, or if you don't have chicken stock, you can use water, and then you just add, um, you know, some salt, pepper, and some seasonings to it. But I have chicken stock, so as I said, this is eight cups. And like I mentioned, you guys can add anything else to it, onions, or you make it work for your family here. Um, this works for us um, right now, especially since I can't have um, onions and garlic right now. And rather than making double batch, it's better for me to just do this. So there is our liquid. Okay, so now my heat is up to medium high. And while that... So that's going to come up to a boil. Once it comes up to a boil, I will add my pasta and then the chicken and then the soup is done. Alright, so now that you can see here our, our liquid is boiling, so I'm going to add a cup and a half of the orzo in and then we'll give it a nice little stir again. And at this point, I think I'm also going to add a tad bit of salt. Now I have um, pink Himalayan salt. I have this big container here. And not adding much. 
just two pinches of salt. And we're gonna let this cook for about five minutes. And then we'll add our chicken. And that'll be it for our soup. All right, so we're back up to a boil. Our pasta has been cooking for about five minutes. Now I'm just gonna put this chicken that I mentioned before. It's already pre-cooked. It's a rotisserie chicken. This is just the chicken breast that I took off of the chicken that we had left over. In it goes. And another good stir. And then we'll just let it simmer again for a bit and we will have soup ready to eat for our lunch. All right, and just like that, our soup is done. There's orzo and chicken throughout. Now I am gonna put some in a bowl here. All right. Let's get a nice get a little more liquid here. And there you go. Chicken orzo soup. So there it is, a nice bowl of chicken orzo soup. You can serve this with a uh, breadstick, garlic knots, um, a side salad. We're just gonna have it like this. Um, we're having a late lunch today, so something light so we can actually get our dinner afterwards as well. Okay guys, that was the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already. I would really appreciate it. And don't forget to click the little bell. It'll notify you each and every single time that I post a new video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.